We shall return, though, to the football and the bright side of today for you, Toma. The first time that you have played in front of a full house here after three years and you win. That must be cool. This must be really cool, yes, indeed. Uh, yeah, we had two years. Two years of COVID, uh, difficult situation. I was also injured yeah, last season at the end, uh, the three last months. And I've seen this 81,000 supporters um, where we were playing against Hertha Berlin. The last game that I was on the bench, so it was officially today my first minutes on the pitch with a full stadium. And I'm quite happy with the result and with the, with the atmosphere today. Can you tell me about the difference it makes to you? What, what are the moments when you really feel the 81,000 here as a player? Uh, I wish I could uh, feed them a bit more uh, because I'm, I'm really focused in my game and it's yeah, quite difficult to, to look in the stands, to look to the stands and to even to hear the songs and everything. Uh, but I know they are there. When I take the ball for a train, for example, I, I hate them uh, saying that uh, I'm not a bastard or that kind of things. Uh, so no, no, it's good. It's good. It's good to, to be in Dortmund. It's a, it's a really positive public and we have to we have to put a point on it because sometimes you know when you go. Uh, you know, the stadium it's quite difficult, uh, you know, it's really hostile and uh, and playing in Dortmund is just like a dream, you know, and you, you, you enjoy every time. Thomas, congrats on the win and also on the Thank clean you. sheet. I know Thank you as a defender, much. it's very important to have a clean sheet. What is the difference, so Eden Terzic, what does it demand of you and also of you as a team? Because today you look very, very stable in the, in the, in the whole team. Uh, yes, we were really stable, we have to show so that we can um, be dominated. Uh, but I don't really like that kind of situation because the second half was not good. Uh, we needed to, to, yeah, to be a bit more dominant. We are playing at home. But why was that? Why was that? Why, were, why was the second half so different? I, I don't know. I don't know. I think uh, honestly we had a really, really um, good and exhaustive preparation. Uh, I think no. The, even during the training you saw this week, it was sometimes a bit difficult to give everything and to be 100% uh, focus and. Uh, at some interval of time today, we, we had this, this problem to, to keep the ball, to, to, to take the, the fresh uh, decision um, that can make the difference. And, uh, but at least, yeah, we defended really well. Gregor saved uh, two wonderful balls. Um, they have two can save goals also. We were a bit lucky, we have to say. But uh, at least, yeah, the clean sheet is there. And, and about myself, yeah, you know, when you play against Diaby, for example, they, sure. We know it's, it is quite a dangerous player, but I think we did the job perfectly. And, uh, and today on my side, and even in general, we, we, were, we were good. Not very good, but good. Tom, thank you very much for joining us. Is it still true that your teammates are calling you David Beckham and Zinedine Zidane when you're scoring goals? <laughs> not anymore, not anymore, not because I still have to I have to score this season, maybe later it will come. But, uh, okay, well, Thomas told, I, us I that, it will come back. Thomas told us that on ESPN last season. We'll see if the goals start to flow again, Thomas. So. Thank, thank you very much, much for joining us. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.